Hey guys, how's it going today? Um, we're gonna work on Fisher projections and how to change those to Hayworth projections. Um, we're gonna start off with D-glucose. Uh, D-glucose being because the hydroxyl group on our fifth carbon is on the right side. And um, how to change this into a Hayworth projection is that we're going to make a pentose sugar and we're gonna label pentose sugar one, two, three, four, five, and six for our carbons. Um, First, I like to label my uh, Fisher projection and label my left going up and my right going down. This will help me determine uh, which groups are going up and down on my Hayward projection. So I like to start off with my second carbon. And the second carbon, the hydroxyl group is going down. And the hydrogen is going up. Third group, hydrogen is going down and my hydroxyl group is going up. Fourth group is my hydroxyl group is going down, my hydrogen group will be going up. Um, for my fifth and sixth carbon, this determines if it's going to be D sugar or an L sugar. D sugars, uh, the CH2OH group will be going up, and my hydroxyl group will be going down. Um, for L sugar, it's a little bit different. You just flip these two the CH2OH and the hydrogen. Um, for my anomeric carbon, this will determine if it's beta or alpha uh, D-glucose. And since we're going to start off with beta, we're going to put the hydroxyl group going up, my hydrogen going down. And then for alpha, we should do that vice versa. Hydroxyl group down, hydrogen group going up. I got this as alpha. All right, now I'm gonna show you how to do a alpha, beta, L sugar. So now we're gonna do our L sugar. Uh, we're gonna start off with L glucose. We're gonna do basically the same thing we did with our D sugars. Um, pretty easy stuff. Uh, so our L sugar, I dropped it on the left instead of the right. Um, we're gonna label it the same way. Left group going up, right group going down, and we have hydrogen going down on our second carbon, OH going up, OH going down on our third carbon, hydrogen going up, hydrogen going down on our fourth carbon, and OH going up. Um, CH2, OH going down, since it's an L sugar, it's always down. And we got a hydrogen group going down. All right, now for our anomeric carbon, we're going to start with a beta. So this is going to beta L glucose. And we switch that. And we get OH going up, OH going down. This is now alpha. Easy as that. Um, if there's anything else you want to know, just leave a comment below and uh, we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Bye.